Welcome to section 9.2 of genetics. In this section, we will be memorizing the details of myotonic dystrophy. So let's get started. This scene takes place at a dump, as indicated by the sign here. Deep in this chasm is where people put garbage. Dump will help you remember that the DMPK gene is affected in myotonic dystrophy. So dump for dump K gene. Our story is like a gritty crime movie where mobsters are trying to dispose of a dead body. Look how emaciated this body is. This wasted body will help you remember muscle wasting in myotonic dystrophy. Like most mobster movies, the cops show up and create a climactic showdown. And our story is no exception. Now notice the dominoes hanging from the rear view mirror of the cop car. Dice are more often placed in rear view mirrors like this, but dominoes fit the story better. In any case, these dominoes will help you remember that myotonic dystrophy is an autosomal dominant disorder. Quickly, a cop jumps out of the vehicle. In his excitement, he repeats on his communication system, we caught these guys, we caught these guys. So caught these guys. If you look at the first letter of each word in his proud declaration, caught these guys, you will see CTG for CTG repeats. Now it's these CTG repeats within the DMPK gene that cause all the problems. If you can remember that in our story, the cops caught these guys, you will remember CTG repeats in myotonic dystrophy. Now while the cops weren't looking, an obnoxious teenager tags the side of the police car with his initials, MPK. MPK stands for myotonin protein kinase. As indicated by the name, myotonin protein kinase, this MPK is a protein and it's overexpressed from all these CTG repeats in the DMPK gene. Now notice the lights beaming at these two mobsters in the back. You can see this guy's eyes are reflecting the light in a weird way. This is to help you remember cataracts. Patients with cataracts often complain of having a severe glare from car headlights at night. Often this complaint alone is what leads patients to the doctor. So light reflecting from eyes, cataracts. Now look at the lights beaming off the forehead of this guy. The reflection of light off of his shiny bald head will help you remember frontal bossing. Frontal bossing refers to balding of the frontal portion of the patient. So patients with myotonic dystrophy often have frontal bossing. So light reflecting off bald head, frontal bossing. As you'd expect, these mobsters have more than just one victim. Look at this poor guy. He's getting zapped by the car battery behind him. Pretty cruel. Anyways, it's causing all of his muscles to contract and spasm uncontrollably. Look how stiff he looks. His legs sticking out, his legs straight, arms to his side. He's completely contracted. Now this will help you remember that patients with myotonic dystrophy have myotonia, which means they have a hard time relaxing their muscles just like this guy. For example, a patient with myotonic dystrophy may grip your hand in a handshake, but they won't be able to readily let go. This is myotonia. So this victim is tensed up from the electricity coming from the car battery, which refers to myotonia. Fortunately, this poor myotonic man tensed his leg in just the right way to get some poetic justice for this mobster. You can almost see his testicles explode with this myotonic kick. This testicular destruction here will help you remember testicular atrophy, which is common in patients with myotonic dystrophy. Now let's look more closely at the victim's shirt. Can you see the little heart? The fact that the electricity seems to go directly to his heart indicates that patients with myotonic dystrophy often have arrhythmia. So shocking the heart with electricity for arrhythmia. And with the arrhythmia of the myotonic man, we have wrapped up all the details you need to know about myotonic dystrophy.